Hello and welcome to a new video on this channel. I am Sabi from Code Revolution. I create premium WordPress plugins and sell them on CodeCanyon. Today I will show you how to use the cheapest way I found so far uh, to uh, promote your product and uh, website. Uh, you can use Google Ads for this, but not any Google Ads, but the video ads on YouTube. So you have to have a YouTube channel for this. And first of all, you need to create a video that is about uh, 20 minutes long and where you describe something. It should be a tutorial video. Tutorial videos are the best that uh, can be promoted. And in the tutorial video, you can promote your own product or you can promote other products with an affiliate link. So I selected this video I created. Here I uh, describe how to create an autopilot news website using one of the plugins I created, Newsomatic. In the video description, I also have a link to the plugin. So also I added here uh, I added also end cards and this link here okay so um, one thing to say uh, why I say that uh, this is the cheapest way right now to create uh, ads for your services or website or products I say this because until recently Facebook was the cheapest way to create uh, ads for your products, but now it got much exp more expensive than it was. And now, in my opinion, uh, YouTube video ads are the cheapest. Let me explain this. So, uh, first of all, you will get the clicks and impressions on your uh, views, on your videos. But besides this, if you ask for uh, viewers to subscribe to this channel and actually some of the viewers will subscribe to your, your channel, then the uh, people who subscribe to you will see your future videos for free. So this is a great way for getting free views from uh, paid clicks. So you only paid uh, Google once and they will show you uh, the people who subscribe to your channel they will show your videos uh, from them on indefinitely each time you publish a new video they will show it to them and also one more thing i noticed is that if you boost the video views with paid views then the google and youtube algorithm algorithm will notify uh, this notice this and it will rank the videos higher so in the eyes of the uh, youtube algorithm paid views are not different from organic views so if you boost your video views it will rank higher in search results and because of this it will get more organic traffic okay so let us get started and create our first campaign to boost our videos and products. So, first of all, you will see that the Google Ads uh, dashboard has changed recently. Now it looks like this. If you want to create ads, go uh, click here on the Google Ads. You will see this dashboard. Now you should go to campaigns with this little house symbol and click on the plus click new campaign here we must select product brand uh, product and brand consideration and video here influence consideration is the right one I suggest okay now this uh, setting screen will show it might be intimidating for the first time but uh, you will see that is not hard to configure at all so we should give this a name let's uh, give it a nice name 
I want to promote this video with new Zomatic in it and USA Plus. I will explain why I entered USA Plus here. Budget and dates. I like to put here daily and use about 20 RON. RON is Romania's currency. Uh, it's about so uh, 20 run uh, 20 run is about four dollars76. So I like to uh, leave the daily budget at around five dollars. Okay, so I want to spend in this campaign only maximum five dollars daily. But we will see that I will create multiple campaigns here and I will not spend only $5 daily, but more. Maximum CPV, this is right. CPV is cost per view. This is uh, the strategy I wish I like to use. I also like to allow uh, YouTube to show wherever they wish. YouTube search results and YouTube videos. I, li I like them. I like to allow them to show my uh, ads wherever they like. And also, a very, very important thing is that you should select here the language in which you wish to promote your video or the language in which your video is in. So, this is very important. Select here English if your video is in English. Locations. Select uh, here the locations where you wish to show your ads. If you are a local business, then you should uh, enter here the country or city where your business in, is in. Or if you are a global business, then here you must enter the locations where you wish to the, show the ads. You can leave these all countries, but I like to uh, target a specific locations in my campaign. So I use USA Plus and for me USA Plus means every major uh, country that is English speaking. So this is the United States, United Kingdom, Canada, Australia and maybe New Zealand, but this is optional. So this is the country list I like to use. This is my USA Plus. Inventory type standard, excluded content, this is not interested for me. Additional settings, this is also very, very important for me. All devices, okay, set specific targeting. Because I use, uh, I, I promote a plugin, I like to uh, show my ads only on computers because they have better access to WordPress and they are much higher, uh, they have much higher conversion rates on computers. Okay. So I targeted computers. Fec frequency capping. This is also another very, very important thing I wish to sh share with you. Uh, this means how many times YouTube will show the ad to the same person. So if you enter here one impression cap per month, this means that YouTube will show your ad only one time per month to the same person. Uh, this is very important because uh, if you don't check this, YouTube can waste impressions on the same person and the same person will keep, um, will keep on uh, denying the ad and you will lose your budget. So this is very important in my view. Okay, schedule all day, ad group name. Give it a name, anything you wish. Demographics. This is also an interesting thing uh, to, 
tweak. Uh, female, male, if, you, if your business targets a specific uh, gender, you can select here. If your business targets a specific age, you can select it here. Parental status and household income. This is a very, very nice feature. You can select the household income of people you want to target with ads. So if you want to target only the top household income, you can do it. Audiences, you can select which uh, type, type of people you want to select. You can select technophiles, startup, starting a business soon, and there are many, many, many categories you can search here from. I will leave this to you because I leave this blank right now. Keywords. Also, you can enter keywords uh, where you want your ads to show. You can narrow the reach with keywords. So here, uh, you can also use competitor keywords. If you have any competitor in your domain, you can enter their keywords here, their name, it is permitted. Also, another thing you can do is copy the link to your uh, product, paste it here, uh, give the product name here. Oh, sorry. And uh, Google will suggest you keywords that are good to be added here, like this. You can add all keywords it suggests, and you can also add multiple keywords from you. Okay. Topics, so you can select topics for the ad. Placements, I leave this at default usually. Maximum cost per view. I like to put here five run, which is uh, one dollar and a bit and this is the maximum amount of money I want to pay for a single view okay and here you can create your ad now I, we should copy the link to our video paste it here <clears throat> and here w another thing that it is very very important in my view you should never select in-stream ads. In-stream ads are the kind of ads that display bit, uh, between videos, uh, not between videos, sorry, between uh, breaks in the video. So these ads go inside of the video and when people watch a video, suddenly the video breaks and your ad comes in. This is <clears throat> very annoying when you have uh, some kind of businesses that like my business so I don't recommend this only if you have the kind of business that uh, comes handy for this so I almost select video discovery ad video discovery ad is the kind of ad that appears in the sidebar of YouTube in the recommended video section this is actually really really great because uh, viewers must go and click on your video to see it so they won't be forced to see your video but they will see your ad they will see your thumbnail will see your title and they will be attracted by it and they will click on it and like this they will almost every time watch it until the end okay the headline of the video this is extremely important to be short because on mobile uh, youtube shows only very very little text they show four words or five at maximum so let's enter here wordpress create autopilot website or how to create autopilot website news website how to create and how to create an autopilot news website this fits, I think, in the 
a mobile <coughs> view for the ad. Okay. In the description, you can select, you can enter, learn how to create passive income. Okay, and in description do to autopilot website. Add name also give this a name. Add one. Also video. So most mo and most important thing is the thumbnail for the ad this must be something that is clickable and the headline of the ad these two are the most important things for your ads okay so we covered everything in settings now we can go and tweak settings and look also in the weekly estimates so these are the weekly estimates that uh Google gives us it estimates that we will get around 110 and 440 views impressions are between 11 and 41,000 cost per view will vary between this budget spend uh, this is uh, depending on how much money you have in your account okay and this is the pool of people that can be targeted at maximum with your campaign so based on the settings you have set for the, the ads campaign these many people can be targeted with it okay so now we've finished our campaign we can hit save and continue and congrats you created your first google ads campaign now it will have to be approved by google and after it is approved it will start and run for you and it will promote your video don't forget to create a nice video don't forget uh, to ask people to subscribe inside your video and don't forget to add links to your product and affiliate links if you have any and don't forget to create a, a good a description for the video and you will see that conversion will rise subscribers will come and views for your channel will be increased very much okay so this is all for now i hope this video was helpful for you don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the bell notification to get notified each time I release a similar tutorial video here on my channel. And this is all guys. Until next time, have a great day. Bye bye.